Hey everybody, guess what day it is? It's May 5th today. We all know it's a special day and we are cooking everything Mexican in my house this evening. First going in the oven is my sheet pan fajitas. So I have my chicken marinated in my Apicure fajita seasoning. The other end I have all my different colors of peppers and I'm going to throw this sheet pan in the oven at 400, probably about 15 or 20 minutes till that chicken's cooked. In my frying pan, I have some of Epicure's taco. We've used tonight Epicure's meal solution with the taco seasoning. Just mix it. This is more um, like the one you might find in the store. You mix it with the cup of water and add it to your ground beef. It helps if you turn your stove on and let it simmer till it thickens up that sauce. And while my fajitas are in the oven, my fajita sheet pan, Nothing wants to stand up here for me. <laughs> I'm going to make some salsa. So I've diced up some tomatoes. I'm going to use Epicure's Poco Picante. Now this has a little bit of a bite to it, so I'm only going to add a teaspoon because I don't like my salsa to burn my mouth. I like a little bit of heat, but if you put a full tablespoon like that calls for, it's gonna be hot. So mix that up and I mean, you see how quick that was. I threw the tomatoes in my little dicer, pull the cord and it dices them. So that took all of 30 seconds to make some fresh salsa at home. And to save a minute, I've already crushed up my avocados. I was going to call them my guacamoles, but they're not guacamoles. And I'm going to add a good splash of lime juice. And again, I'm going to use Epicure's guacamole seasoning tonight. So much nicer to make just what you need at home. I'll throw about one and a half tablespoons in there and I'll see if I have enough because I only have two small avocados. That looks like it'll be more than enough seasoning. It's so nice to make this at home. I might just take a small avocado and that's my snack in the afternoon. I have a little bit of guacamole with a couple of chips or even with some sliced vegetables, some carrots, cucumber. They're great dip dipped in guacamole. So there you go. By the time we are ready to eat dinner, the guacamole is ready, the salsa is ready, the tacos will have simmered and I'll be able to pull out my sheet pan fajitas in the oven here. So I got my peppers and my marinated chicken, and those should take about 20 minutes.